sponsored by Aqua Beads. Oh, he's so cute. Wow. Looks like I need a few more pieces. And here's my duck, you guys. Quack, quack. It's very cute and it's 3D. Yeah, kind of. Oh, you just finished. Yum, 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 yum. Aren't they so cute, you guys? Whoa. Whoa. It turned into a stuffed animal. What is happening? What's up, guys? Hi, it's Madison here. And Trinity. You guys know we love animals. So when we got home from school today, we grabbed our bug boxes and we went to go find some bugs, but we didn't find any. It's too hot for snails and it's not hot enough for lizards. That's right, you guys. We couldn't find anything out here in our backyard. So instead of finding animals out here, we're gonna go inside and make our own. Oh yeah, Trin, let's go. All right, guys, we're back inside, and all of these kids behind me are gonna be used to make our animals. That's right, you guys. We've got three kids of aqua beads, and we're gonna make a lot of cute animals with them. Should we make a bunny? Should we make a parrot? You'll have to watch and find out. I'm gonna start with the beginner's carrier case because I wanna make this cute little bunny. Or maybe that dolphin. Or maybe even both, who knows? And I'm gonna use both of these because I wanna use a lot of aqua beads. But first, I don't know if you guys seen, but we got a new island and we're gonna show you something really cool about it. Trent? Whoa, it's so cool. Whoa, turn that is way too bright. Turn it down, turn it down, turn it down. That better? Much better. You guys, with the table turned off, we can probably see what we're making even better. All right, so let me show you how these work. It's actually pretty easy. First, you have to put down your template, and then it shows you exactly how to do it. It's so easy. Look, I got a dog, a dragonfly, and a butterfly, and the penguin, and it shows you exactly where to put them. It's so cool. Yeah, you guys, it's super easy. You just build your design on here, and I'm using the pen. I think it's easier, so let me show you how it works. So you see this? You just push it down, and the bead is right where you want it. And if you run out or you need a refill, you just put beads in this hole. And if you can't tell, I'm making a bunny. All right, you guys, I've entered my penguin template, but I decided to add some ice on the bottom. You can be creative and add something else. Next step is to spray your character with a ton of water. Hey, Jaren, how's it going? Pretty good, I'm just moving on to my next color. All right. All right, now we have to count to 10 and then flip this over. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. Now time to flip the tray quickly. Ready, three, two, one. Whoa. Now I'll let it dry for five minutes. Before I start my next creation, I have to dry off the excess water. All right, Madison's penguin is looking super cute, but let's go check in on Trim. All right, Trin, how's it going? Good, just reloading. Just finishing on filling in the ears, and then I'll do the carrot, and I'm done. Oh, and if you didn't notice, I'm using the new star beads. I'm actually gonna move this over here to finish drawing and start my next creation. All right, I just sprayed my bunny, and it's been 10 seconds, so let's flip it over. Oh, he's so cute. All right, while we wait for those two to drink, I found a more trickier one that we can both do together. Trin, so there's one where like, there's a duck sitting in a pond, so one of us would have to make the duck, and the other would have to make the pond. Okay, I'll make the pond. Oh good, I wanted to make the duck, so let's get started. All right, just finishing up the water for the duck pond. Oh, looks like I need a few more pieces. And done. And empty the extras. All right, let's spray it with some water. And here's my duck, you guys. Hey, Trin, can I have the water, please? Thank you. Sprint, sprint, sprint. Finish my pond. Finish my duck. Quack, quack. All right, Madison, you go turn the light off on the island, and let's go set our creations down there to dry. Whoa! Whoa! Madison, what happened to our creations? They became stuffed animals! It's adorable, but our aqua bee creations, they turned into stuffed animals? How? How? You guys, if our aqua bee creations just turned into stuffed animals, then I would make as many aqua bee creations as I possibly can, so I can have more stuffed animals! Let's go! All right, let's go check on the girls and see what they've decided to create this time. 
Madison, what are you working on? Yeah, kind. Oh, you just finished. All right, guys, so I just finished making two stars and a big flower, and I'm making six smaller flowers. It's gonna end up being a flower garden, so I'm gonna finish them up and then take them all down there to dry. All right, Madison, what are you working on over here? So, uh, this was my ladybug, but that doesn't look like a ladybug to me. So I decided to turn it into a snow cone, and I'm not gonna give up, because I'm not a quitter, so I'm trying this ladybug. It's gonna be a bit harder. Right here, and right there. Beep. Finished! And I wanna show you guys my turtle and my dinosaur. They're so cute! Yum, 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 yum. Yay! Yum, 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 yum. Aren't they so cute, you guys? All right, guys, I'm done with my flower garden. And I'm done with my ladybug. Three, two, one. Woo! What? Mr. Quacky, how did you get here? What are you doing? Something strange is definitely happening. Yeah, tell me about it. Every time we make a new aqua bee, it turns into a stuffed animal. Like what is happening? I kind of like it. Let's go make more. Come on. Madison, I think we've figured out what's going on. So whenever we make an aqua bee and set it over there to dry, it becomes a stuffed animal. <gasps> Madison, what are you doing? You just ruined your thing. Well, Trent, if everything we make turns into a stuffed animal, I really want a stuffed animal dolphin. Put it way over here to dry and wait for my new plush dolphin. All right, you guys, let's show you what we got done right now. I made this 3D elephant. It was kind of hard to make, but it looks really cute now. And I made a really cute sloth. They're one of my favorite animals. And look at this cute little snail I made. What's your guys' favorite animal? Mine's a wolf. I'll probably make that one next. Here's the little flower garden that I made. It's very cute and it's 3D. You guys, I just figured something out with my elephant. Look, he could have a little trunk or a big trunk. Mm. Aw, oh, man! My dolphin never turned into a dolphin! Hmm, maybe our luck ran out, Madison. Maybe. Maybe they're done becoming stuff. What's up, girls? Hi! Um. We just had something really strange go on with that. So like, aqua when we made our aqua beads, they were turned into a stuffed animal. What? That was crazy, yeah. so everything you made turned into a stuffed animal? Yes. Yeah. Not my dolphin though, look. Oh man. You know why that one didn't turn into a stuffed animal? Why? Because I scoured your girls' room and I could not find a stuffed dolphin. What? What? <laughs> There's a huge dolphin sitting in my room. What? Well, your room is a mess, Trent. <laughs> I couldn't find it. Then Dad, if you were giving us the stuffed animals, then where's our aqua beans? Where's Shrimp's bunny? Where's my penguin? Yeah! Hey! All right, there's your duck, there's a bunny, there's a penguin. Bunny! All right, there's the 3D little duck in the pond. Thank you, Mommy. All right, the girls, I'll be right back. Wait. Huh? You guys, where is he going? Is he going to get more stuffed animals? Because we know it's him now. Hmm. All right, who made the dolphin? Madison? All right, here's you, a dolphin. Thank you, you Mr. Hunter. That's my dolphin! Actually, it's mine now. Thanks again to Aqua Beats for sponsoring this video. Well, guys, thanks for being our awesome fans. We'll see you in our next video. Bye. Aqua Beats!